Hi guys, happy Sunday. It's your podcaster Helen. And I just wanted to say that I am so grateful for waking up today. What are you grateful for? I woke up today, made breakfast, and I went to work. And I decided that I needed to podcast this evening because I had an amazing opportunity to be a guest on the Broke Boy podcast today. It was an amazing opportunity. This is a fun and happy and positive and just exhilarating podcast that I had an opportunity to be a guest on. And that's what us podcasters do. We just try to do our best in building a community. And it was just something that I really needed on this Sunday. Sometimes we can let life stress us out. I was a little stressed, but I had already accepted the invitation and I went through with it and it was an amazing 30 to 45 minute podcast and I really enjoyed it. And I would ask that you guys support and tune into the Broke Boy podcast and support support not only him but every other podcaster that's out here that's giving you feedback time trying to enlighten you on different topics and subjects sometimes it can get a little hectic in life and just whatever we can do to bring positivity light and happiness to you guys we try to do it so i would ask that you tune into it We got a chance to get to know one another and just talk. Um, He's from Nebraska, which we know that's kind of a small city. And he got a chance to just talk about the things that he's doing in life. Um, And I plan on having him on my podcast very soon. So you guys can tune in and hear what we have to talk about. So I won't shed too much on what we talked about because I'm definitely going to have him on my podcast really soon. But um, this is a podcast that he's building and it's been out for a little bit and he is doing amazing at podcasting. And so I wanted to bring that to you this Sunday evening as I sit here on my porch. It's nice and cool and I was a little stressed today, but it's kind of like alleviating and I'm feeling better about life and just loving life and being able to bring life to you guys. And I just wanted to ask, what are you grateful for today? I'm grateful for waking up today. I'm grateful for the time that I have to spend with family and friends. Um, Sometimes we don't take enough time to say what we're grateful for because life can be really short. So we really need to say what we're grateful for. And sometimes in life, you just come across a lot. You know, I look at the young kids playing out in the field football and I love outdoorsy kids because these days, so many kids sit inside the house and they don't get a chance to interact with other kids. And that's your social skills. Your social skills mean a lot to you when you're a kid. And I know I didn't sit in the house. I rode my bicycle, I skated, I skated on skateboards. I I really was a tomboy growing up. So um, I love when I see the kids outside and they're riding their bikes or they're playing football and they're interacting with other kids. It means a lot. So parents, please allow your kid to go outside and still play. I know things are crazy these days, but if you have to sit on the porch and watch them, please allow them to have that playtime with other kids. Social skills mean so much these days because it's giving a kid the opportunity to know, hey, oh my God, if mom and dad's not around one day, I could be a teenager, 18, 19, and you didn't get a chance to get the social skills that you needed and you're outside, it means a lot. So I would ask parents to please, if you have to sit on a porch, if you have to take a chair and put it on the the walkway, if you live in an apartment community to watch your kid play, please allow them to have that time out to be able to interact with other kids and gain those social skills. It means a lot growing up 
you really need it because the kid is knowledgeable not only to what another kid is thinking but how they're also moving because bullying these days is totally different from bullying when I was growing up as a kid. I, of course, I went through it and that's a subject that I won't get into too deep because I plan on speaking on it later in an episode in my podcast, but just making sure that your kid has the social skills that they need not only helps them early in life, but later in life as well. So I would ask any parent, if you're out there, to please, if you have to take your chair, even if it's hot and you don't feel like doing it, take a fan, take a, some ice water, whatever you need to do, but let your kid get those social skills that they need. Um, it really matters, and I love my outdoorsy kids in my neighborhood. I do. I, they call me, hey, that's the popsicle lady, because I always have a popsicle for them if they need a popsicle if it's hot out there and so just please allow your child your children to get the social skills that they need so um not veering off the topic but it's just sunday being grateful being grateful for something i was grateful just to sit on my porch and watch those kids out there playing and make sure that they were safe that nobody was bothering them and so it's just about building a community, a community of caring people, a community of just loving on one another and bring positivity and light. And I always speak on that because I have a light inside myself and it shines really bright. And sometimes even if you have that light and it shines bright, some things can just kind of like darken it. But then you just woo and come back in full circle and still try and spread that positivity. But I'm one of those people, even if I'm not feeling well, if somebody else needs my attention, I put what I'm feeling on the back burner and give them what they need. So that's just me. But I just wanted to speak on the fact that I had a great opportunity to be on guest on the Broke Boy podcast. It's an amazing podcast. And I think everybody should just tune in. I didn't think I would be a podcaster listener neither. But now that I've gotten into it, I love it. And I realize how much information and feedback you can give to one another by being and listening um, to these podcasts. So I would say don't just send a like if I put out my podcast. Come on, at least listen at the episode so that you can respond, so that you can give feedback you know, and it means a lot. My episode that I did on Friday, debit cards versus cash, I'm looking for more feedback on that. I haven't gotten too much feedback and I'm looking for feedback. I really need feedback. What do you think? 20 or $50 in your pocket. I need feedback. And I, I don't think that it takes much time. If you can like me, if I put out a photo of myself twerking, if you can go up there and look at that, then you can go up there and listen at what I have to say on my podcast. If you're a friend, especially on my Facebook or my Instagram page, then you can go up there and listen at my podcast. It's not going to take too much time out of your day to listen at it. I try not to make them long and boring. I try to make them short, fun, sweet, and right to the point. So I think that if I can listen at you, if you have something to say on Facebook or Instagram, if you're my friend, and even if you're not, if you're just a follower, you know, just go up there and say something, you know, respond. If it's a question that I'm asking you for response on, it makes a difference. And that's us building one another up. And I feel like we need to take time for more positive things than non-positive and I'm not saying twerking's bad because you know I like to dance it might not be twerking but I like to dance and there's nothing wrong with twerking I like to see it so just let's just take a little bit of time stop what we're doing we could be cooking in the kitchen and put it on and say hey well I listened at what she had to say it might be something that's for you or something for you to share with your kid because I try to make it general and where everybody can listen to it. So 
I just asked for that, but I just wanted to come to you this Sunday because I was so excited that I had an opportunity to be a guest on a podcast show other than my own. And it was a wonderful episode, and I cannot wait when he release it to let you guys go on his site so that he can get that feedback from our episode. And we're just bringing light, positivity, and love and information to you, our family. So just go on the episode when I post it make a comment make a comment on my debit card versus cash i'm looking for more comments because there is definitely a prize that i'm giving out for the person that gets the right number so please go up there and listen and let's just build one another up and continue to love on one another as a community and until my next episode which probably won't be until tuesday have a good evening bye